Welcome to a composites video from the Ultralight Airplane Workshop. My name is Leon. In this video, we are going to show some time lapse of preparing tubing for vacuum resonant fusion. I recently did a video on preparing vacuum tubing for vacuum bagging and vacuum resonant fusion, and I'll put a link to that up here in the upper right hand corner. In that video, I did just a little bit of demonstration, but mostly I talked about preparing the tubing. I'm getting ready to do an experiment and run some time lapse of a vacuum resonant fusion. I thought, let's just go ahead and video some of the clips of preparing the tubing for this little experiment, and I'll put a time lapse together. And partly it'll be entertaining, and partly it'll be a more thorough demonstration of the techniques that I talked about in the previous video. Well, let's get to it.
I wanted to point out something about the tubing bending that you saw in this time lapse. Most of this is strictly unnecessary. I did a lot of these bends because I'm going to be taking a time lapse video of these samples as I do an infusion. So I wanted the tubing to be out of the way of the view of the samples. So for example, the bands here, making the straight section, this band, not really necessary. The polyethylene has enough flexibility that I could have just attached a piece here, run it around, allowing its natural limited flexibility to come around and come in without putting undue tension on this part. And again, on my bypass line, I put a bend here, I straighten this section, and I put this twisted S bend in here. If I was doing an effusion without taking any video, I wouldn't have bothered with that. Again, I would have just attached a tube from this connector to this connector over here. I probably wouldn't have bothered to put any bends in it. Maybe just a very slight bend right here to help it come around this curve, but that would have been about it. So this video ended up showing a lot more bending than you would typically need to do on your resin infusion. Stay tuned to the channel, there are a lot more videos on the way.